One by one, hospitals across the Mahoning and Shenango Valleys are starting the process of inoculating their doctors and staff against the coronavirus. As First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti tells us, logistics and time will also figure into the vaccination process. As the nationwide rollout of COVID-19 vaccines continues, dozens working at Sharon Regional Medical Center started rolling up their sleeves this afternoon to be the first to receive vaccinations there. The initial batch of 975 doses arrived yesterday from Pfizer, with more coming next week. We will then get another 975 doses three weeks later for all the persons that get it in the meantime to get their reflex dose. Under state and federal guidelines, this round of vaccine was set aside specifically for what are being called Tier 1 workers who come in direct contact with patients. It's not just the frontline nurses and doctors um, or nursing assistants. We, thought we also have to think about our phlebotomy people. Um, our laboratory people, our, our security guards. While other hospitals in Mercer County were able to receive the vaccine earlier, the state stepped in to make sure Sharon had the needed refrigeration equipment on site before the first shipment arrived. We have our own storage right now in place. And then, of course, we've got a backup plan for any reason why that freezer would fail. Although Sharon is considered a smaller community hospital, it could take a month to six weeks before everyone on staff who wants vaccinated can get their shots because of scheduling, social distancing, and other concerns. Okay. In Sharon, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.